How to make map location markers in Minecraft Java and Bedrock Edition. We'll start off with Java and then go to Bedrock. So as you can see, this map right here has map location markers of different things around the map that I've labeled. So for example, the base, the mines, and then a fishing area and a farm. Now you can add as many of these markers as you want to, to your map. You can just have it one map like the middle map here. You can also add a map wall to have multiple maps together as well. But in this case, it's just a singular map. You can also have a much expanded map too. So I could add labels stuff to say over here, over here or anywhere on this large map and it would show up. Or I can just stick to this small map which is the map that I've got in my hand. Now, to be able to add a marker to a map, all you need to do is get yourself a banner and you want to name the banner in an anvil. So you craft a banner with six wool and one stick. Just go to an anvil and name it. In this case, I've already got this one named to village. Then you just go to where you want it to display on your map. So in this case, we're just going to place it here. Go to your map and click on the banner with your map and then this will work. So if I click on the banner right here, as you can see, the map flickers for a second and then it will be added to the map and it is on the small map in my hand, and also the much larger map wall, as you can see. Unfortunately, on Minecraft Bedrock Edition, you can't use banners for location markers, but you can still do this using a different method. You can, first of all, either get a mod or an add-on that allows you to do this with banners, or, as you can see on my map right now, there is a little green dot where one of my locations are. So I can simply follow this, I can go through here, and then this is where the map actually is. So basically the way this works is instead of having banners with labels, you just place a map in an item frame. Now we could also have this as a map wall, so we can have more item frames here, make this a much larger map as well. However, in this case, it's just a small one for example. But let's say I wanted to add another location to this map. Well, I'm going to add my gold farm for this example. So this is my gold farm. I'm just going to place an item frame with a map inside. And as you can see, there's now a little green dot where the map is here. And there is still one over at the other map as well. So if we go back to the other map, then this one will now show on there as well. So as you can see, there's now a green dot for the gold farm as well as the one here at the base. And you can, of course, expand this, make the map as large as you want to. And then you can have as many of these different green dots too. Now you can't label them, but you'll know roughly what they are based on where they are on the maps. And if you don't, you can just go to them and you'll know what they are instead. For example, you could have an XP farm, you could have mines, you could have a base, you could even mark all your friends' bases as well on your map. And then, of course, other people can also use your map to be able to find your base or other stuff that you want to find if you place maps on walls in item frames. This will only work using a locator map, which you can craft with a normal map and then a compass. And then you'll get yourself a locator map for this to be able to work. If you play Minecraft on multiplayer and you're fed up of having to wait for everybody to sleep for you to be able to skip the night, well, don't worry, as now you can skip the night with just one person sleeping in a Minecraft multiplayer world without cheats on Bedrock Edition. Check out the video on screen to learn how.